Us, we're down blocking, circling off. All right. Now, a lot of times when guys shoot high crotches and attack, their hand will come right back up. Okay, good boy, Sam. So, a lot of times when we're wrestling, this is what will happen. I'm a right leg lead, my right hand's my attack hand. So I'll level change, I'll attack, and then I'll build back up, boom, and then my hand comes back home. Whether it comes outside or whether it comes inside. So partner, we're going to shoot, we're going to come back home to where our hands are set. That's where we're going to get that little bit of pressure with the arm that we're going to chop through and start chasing the angle. All right? So. I'm going to be on the elbows now. We've been staying home, right? And if you want to keep staying home, stay home. Doesn't matter to me. If you feel like you need to connect with the elbows, then connect with the elbows. So I'm on the elbows, Sam drops his level, shoots, I'm backing up, okay? I still want hands to drop up, okay? See how bad my defense is? Hands didn't drop. He shoots, boom, hands drop right here. Now, as I start to come back up, this outside hand's going to chop, and I'm going to feed to that drag. Okay, I'm gonna feed to that drag. And you can start chopping and feed to that drag before you even get back to your stance. So he shoots, boom, down block right here. I can stop chop, I can chop outside, I can chop inside, right here. Start feeding to that drag and hustling down, all right? Kimbrough's stepping inside. He's chopping through and stepping inside. This isn't wrong. But the reason why I like stepping outside too is if this guy starts to square hard, I can just drop into my double. See how my right leg's already in? And it gives me a pretty good, pretty good opportunity to finish there. So find where you want to start getting to your drag. Is it right out of your down block? You're, you're chopping and chasing that drag and circling? Do you want to come back to your feet a little higher? Tony, come hit one of yours. You got one of the best ones in the room. Give him that shot. Boom, right here. He just feeds right to it. Do it again. He's just getting his head in the way. He's lowering that level. And that's where his judo background's coming in. See how he's coming off the elbow and feeding it? Do it slow one time. Do it, do it real slow. Watch his left turn. Turn, turn, oh, turn. <laughs> turn right here. Watch this left hand. Watch this left hand. See how he's feeding it? See how he's feeding it early? He just feeds almost elbow passing. So find your rhythm in there. If your hands are dropping, you might have to come back up and chop. If you're on the elbow, you might be able to guide it straight down. Okay? He's on this elbow right here. When he feels this attack hand release right here, he's down blocking. Boom. See how he's feeding it? We can go ear to shoulder like Ryland's going. We can step in. All right? Find out where you want to feed that arm to. But at the end of the day, it's head in the way, that, that, that shot's coming, boom, right there, okay? He shoots, I like going hands down, coming back in, chop, get into it, okay? Especially if they're fighting back inside with a straight arm. It's real easy to chop. I'm, so, I'm trying to circle. I don't ever want to back straight up. If he's shooting, you're talking about that? No, so like when they put their hand back up, you're talking about taking a step back and straighten his arm up. Um, you're talking about stepping back here? No, because I'm going away to go forward. Right? If I get here and his collar tied, I'm not going to be able to drag him anyways. It's when that arm comes back up inside, just kind of to post. That's when I can drag. If he comes back up collar tied, there's no drag here. Okay? So, partner, don't come back up to that collar tie because we're focused on drags. So if I'm, shooting, if I'm shooting on Tony, I'm shooting, then my hand's coming back up. Boom. If I come up to a collar tie, we're in a whole different hand fight situation. Okay, so attack hand comes back up to a post. So I'm shooting, come back up to a post. Boom, right there. Go as slow as you need to. Start finding out you're coming inside. Just be careful. This, is, this has got to be perfectly timed. Okay, this is a little bit easier to feed. Give me a post. This is a little bit tougher to feed, right? A little bit more action than that, okay? A little bit more action. Coming inside and trying to clear out, that takes a little bit more time. You can play with both. Go!